on two microphones. Hell yeah. Anyway, guys, it looks like we are going to be getting live now into uh, Funny Bee versus Stick, and it is going to be on Sinister. Three, two, and one. let's check out what damage they're going to be able to do to each other. I'm going to start on Stick, and he's going to be getting the top red spawn. Now he's getting They're meeting up so close so soon. Funny Bee, he's got you awful weapons for this engagement, and Stick Hand gets a super early first blood. He still hits two rails, which is more than he hit the last time he played Sinister this during 10 minutes. Isn't it more than he hit the entire last best of five? Probably. Or close to. Oh, it's a good attack from Funny B. I mean, he actually gets. How frag. did that turn into a kill? Stickhan went from hitting lots of LG in the first fight to practically nothing in that one. Uh, he should be pretty ashamed of himself for letting that happen, but it might turn it around again in a second. Funny B, he needs to protect this mega health, and he's just not quite able to do that. <laughs> what? <laughs> or maybe he is. And yeah, I think if you're stick can, you can't help but laugh at what just happened there. Uh, Funny B does need to get himself into a position for the red. He's taking his time getting there, but he does need the right weapons for this. Stick can trying to peek his face over, almost receiving some direct rockets. Funny B has the rail. I don't think he realizes this. Uh, yeah, I don't know why he didn't seem so interested in using it. Then. He finds a rocket on the floor, but they're not even trying to fight for this mega health because it's ages until it spawns. And Funny B's just going to be able to extend his frag lead pretty damn easily. Oh, we know Stick and likes to fight. I'm just not sure if he like to fight versus Funny B. Yeah. And I think Funny B might be feeling a little bit more comfortable playing against Stick and then playing against Tox. He seemed almost helpless against Tox. And I'm really wondering who's going to be the first person who can uh, stand a good chance against him. Spazborg, definitely going to have something to say about that in his uh, winner bracket semi. Well, let's see, Funny B's just hit a pretty decent rail. He's probably going to let that lower yellow go. And uh, we'll, we'll hopefully see a little bit of a fight at Mega, but I almost hope that Stickin doesn't turn up to this. But he's been so aggressive lately, of course he wants to do a bit of damage. But one thing is different to actually doing, because he did nothing just then. Oh, there well, we go. The red. There's the damage. It all turned into something uh, for Stick and some kind of opportunity, but Funny Bee now turning it around with some great rails and a little bit of LG at the end for his fourth kill. And I wonder if Funny Bee's gonna be able to find a little bit of momentum as well. Still plenty of time on this map, and maybe Stick and he's gonna start adapting to this game a little better than he was in his uh, series against Spazwalk. Megan right up at the same time. Good move on Funny Bee to go to the mag with Stick and. Direct. Yeah, awesome, but I feel as if it didn't mean anything after the item so Funny Bee just picked up. He just picked up 250 uh, health and armor with some resources, and that's going to be another it, kill. It would be much more helpful if it was actually after the items were picked up. Mm -hmm. That really served him to, to gain like 15 seconds of survival. Yeah, and he couldn't survive. Funny be trying to trace him across uh, the sections of the map. And he needs to get himself over to that mega health very soon, or those two can't make a challenge. And I just come to expect it that he'll be there, but this time he doesn't. Oh, okay. <laughs> he was hiding he was. somewhere. I couldn't hear where he was, but Funny be sensed something. Oh, there we go. A couple of rockets. And going for the rail at the end. Not hitting quite as many as before. He's trying to get the rail shot going, Funny Bee missing as well. Stickan, he had a good chance there to even get a kill because Funny Bee wasn't able to finish the job so fast. Yeah, I'm not sure. I think, however, this could be counterproductive for Stickan because now he feels like he can go into fights with much less stack mm -hmm. and still have a chance. Like now he's pushing in for the Mega. And oh. yeah, he's going to die, but again, he does a lot of damage. But after the fight, Funny Bee is one to be. Is this the same thing oh, that happened in the last awesome. in the last time he played? But now he actually managed to get an attack before the red stick. Successful. Can he make something out of this? Funny Bee doesn't want to let go of the control just yet. Machine gun is a good weapon switch there by Stick and now he's starting to make back some ground here on the scoreboard. And we actually see some decent plays now from Stickhand. Mega and Red coming up at the same time. Great. Looks like he wants to defend this Mega. He even gets his kill, a kill on the way. But he's got to be careful. If Funny Bee spawns over at Red, then he's going to have to say bye bye to it. But it's gone, it's gone beautifully. He couldn't have hoped for anything more. He even is getting a kill, man. It's just turned into a two frag uh, uh, difference between these two. Funny Bee's going to come back up the bounce pad, and this is going to be a six now for Stickhand. What a turnaround we're seeing in this game. Just a little bit of momentum and he got five frags back to back. But that is beautiful. That happened in like less than a minute and a half or something. I, I'm 
I'm putting some ghost mark the house against managed to do this. Wow. Get, can. get another frag mirror funny be connected in here. Oh, oh. But five minute warning. For the mirror, after the mago is taken. That's yeah. the weekend. Gets the red, the yellow, and he's he's ready to another fight. This money be gonna come through the teleport? No, of course can't he that would be suicidal. But he's still in a very dangerous position and anyway. And now wow, stunning shots and another rail afterwards. Stickan, he just seems on an absolute roll now after a very troublesome first half of the game. Well, first off, first couple of minutes. This looks much more like it. Red, though, is taken by Funny Bee, so he's definitely got resources to work with now, but he's got to be careful. Oh my god. He's hitting a lot of great rails now. He's on 26%. How much? 30 now. Okay, yeah, but th th that's after all the rails that he would have been missing early on. But he's definitely making the best of it now. Although, I'm, there's still so much time left on the map that I feel like Funny B, he can turn things around and he actually turns around just then. 8 to 9, red arm is up. Gotta watch out for these air rockets. That one direct rocket would have killed him. And there's the move back over, no 25 health bubbles. He's probably thinking about the 50. He's gonna attack at the Mega. They're both really, really slow. Funny B doesn't connect and the rocket from Sikan are very, very good. Can he get the frag? Oh, one health left. Another bullet would have killed Funny B. But he makes it happen. Hey, he's got to be careful. If he meets Stickan, yep, I was going to say, then he could die. And that's going to be the lead once more. And for him. However, this game is very, very far from reaching a, a terminal point. We're still going to see a lot of turning around. Yeah. None of the players want to play carefully, they just want to fight. And I'm absolutely okay with that. Wow, Stickan hitting some beautiful shots. He's gonna get that mega health. He can make a move over to red, but he's taking his time getting there. I think Funny Bee, oh no, he's going for lower yellow. So Stickan should have an easy ride onto red armor. Oh, a little bit of a trap trying to be set by Funny Bee, but it doesn't do too much damage to Stickan. Searching for pixels representing Funny Bee. Good rotation by, by Stickan, making sure Funny Bee wouldn't get more than a bottom yellow. I almost want to go over to Funny Bee and just see how is he doing right now. He's playing it, sorry, he's just one red. Okay, this is going to be very nice for him. Sure, Stickan, as long as he maintains control of the Mega, should be looking okay. I mean, Stickan does another red, was just taken and gets rail for that. This Funny Bee should really get out of the place now. That's another rail. This might be a kill for Funny yeah. Bee. Now if Stickan, I don't know why I kept pushing oh, rail. Wow, wow. Funny be making it stick there, 48 health. He's just dying for this red armor to spawn. He's gonna be able to get it. Top yellow is up for him. And this this is now suddenly, as you said, man, we're seeing a turnaround. Maybe the first of many more to come. And we're gonna get a drop down from Funny B, but he's weak. A great rocket from Stickan. And that turnaround. Yeah, another turnaround. What is going on? But Funny B wasn't able to tie an air rocket there from Stickan with the rail afterwards, man. What kind of quake are we seeing right now? This is how the Swedes like to do it. <laughs> like what, what's he doing? He's gonna be did careful he really, right now. Did he really rush Funny Bee with the rail out when he had the LG out? I think he's being influenced by Puri a little bit too much. Oh, man, you, you gotta give this guy some credit. He just goes for some sick shots and he is landing a fair few of them. And with just over a minute to go, he's looking like he's well in uh, reach for a map win now against Funny Bee, and there it is. It's going to be 14 to 10. I dare call it GG right now. What do you think? I am really not sure. <laughs> you, <laughs> you seem, uh, you seem suddenly uh, speechless. One minute I, I can't believe what we've been seeing from uh, Stickhand. Uh, I think unless he screws up massively, which he's uh -oh. doing right now. Uh, one rail can still end his life. There is Funny Bee coming up. Oh, he there doesn't get the kill. GG now. And that was it. It's going to be Stickan taking it 15 to 10, I believe, here in map number one. And look at the damage exchange. Exactly wow. the same. Pretty much, yeah. Uh, and super impressive stuff that we saw from Stickan. We definitely saw some uh, frag movie worthy frags going on over here as well for Stickan. I'm, uh, I've got to say, I'm very impressed by what he's shown us.
Now, kind of funny if you bring it back, because we don't really know whose map pick that was. Well, I don't this personally. This was Stickhan's map pick. This was Stickhan's map pick. And then we're going over to Blood Run now, which is Funny Beast. Okay, so Stickhan won his pick, but I could equally imagine Sinister being one of Funny Beast picks. Yeah. So we... I wouldn't imagine Blood Run being one of Stickhan's picks, though. Yeah, I mean, against Spazborg, this was... I think Diabolical was a word I'd use to describe it. It, it didn't go well. I, I'm sure it was like 17 to 1 or happened, but funny be now, with a good chance to uh, get himself a map win as well. Three, and remember now, we're two. in the lower bracket. Whoever loses uh, this game, or sorry, whoever loses this best of five is out of the tournament. And I'm on Stickan off the start. He managed to get red armor, but he's desperately searching for some weapons as well. And I think funny be will have got most of the weapons. Yeah, he's now getting a rail. Oh, but Stickhand getting in his face. Uh oh, Funny B might be in a little bit of trouble here. Stickhand's got the LG, but he's got hardly any ammo left. Funny B, though, he might be able to take advantage. He can't do it. Looking for a rail shot. No one dying at the moment. Oh my goodness. Funny B with 10 health, he jumps to the red. He actually gets it. And he's now attacking he's at the Mega. There's uh -oh. a rail though, one more rail to end his life. He does get the mega health himself, he's gonna surely push Stickhan out of the teleport. He's gonna meet him on the other side, Stickhan misses the rail. And Funny B, he had 95 health, so he would have survived anyway. And this is the start Funny B was looking for. Gotta say, it was hugely messy between them. There we go. I'm I'm getting nervous now when I'm seeing Funny B with his rail out because he hasn't had a you know he's had his moments. He's on 14 percent. He's on yeah 14 percent right now. Mm -hmm. This is why it makes me nervous. Well, and, and I think that his low fly teammates will probably be having a word with him afterwards. Oh, so he gets the rocket. He gets the start of the combo. But what's what's happening with the rail gun? There we are. And I'm sure people uh, watching as well will be expecting a, a lot more rail work from Funny Bee. But uh, let's have a look. He's got himself a lead. I like I like the way he's been using his LG a lot more. So I'd like to see a bit more of this as well. Oh, oh. Stickhand though. Stickhand the rail. Twenty-three health left. Oh my God, Stickhand gets the kill, and he had half the amount of health that Funny Bee had in the end. Not that that really counts for much when you're talking in those low figures. I think Stickhand doesn't want his uh, roll to end now. Are you okay? You look like you sound like you just fell over with your microphone on the floor. The microphone fell off. I <laughs> see Wow, that rocket bounced funny be back miles. Maybe he can get himself onto the red star. I think he just rocket jumped up. Yeah, and Stickhand can get the 50, but funny is a much better position to take the next mag hell. Is Stickhand going to attack at it? By the way, the question that. Whoa, he just suddenly jumps in. Stick, I probably thought he was gonna get a glimpse of that and make a help, but he barely touched it. And now, Funny B, a relatively clean kill, it turns out. He wants some blood. He wants to extend this fragment oh, a little he's bit. He's just here, the pummel there. Stick and waiting in the teleporter. <laughs> That's optimistic. Stick and looking for some plasma damage, won't get it. Funny B, he's gonna go for the rails. Come on. He doesn't, he's not trusting his rails anymore. Yeah. He thought about he thought about it for a good second. Oh yeah, at least. Should I use the rail or the rocket? Is he gonna and jump he past? For the rocket. Okay, so he's gonna forfeit the mega. He's got to win this red. Otherwise, the is coming back in this game fast. He's not even going. Okay, finally goes for a rail. There we are. The shotgun switch. That's Nine gonna. Five percent shot, and that's eighteen damage. Bang. And, uh, Stickhand is starting to throw himself at him a little bit now, but I mean, off the spawn, sure, we, we can't have a go at him too much. Got a nice little drop down from Funny B, and he's now taking it 6 to 1. And uh, this is maybe a result you've been searching for. Wow, okay, Funny B, I think it might be time to heat up your railgun a little more and use it more frequently. Yeah, it's on 46% right now. He's feeling good now. And it, I think it's safe to say that he is out fighting Stickhand in this map. For now. Right, he he just got taken down to 34 health of all that plasma that stick out guard. <laughs> Grenades are gonna hinder his progress. And there's five <laughs> seconds left until it was up and he poked his nose out there. He should have been backing up into a corner. Stickham's gonna get a kill though off the spawn. It's not GG, it's not gonna be over until the 9 minute and 59 second mark. <laughs>
Well, let's see though, because Sticker has still got a lot of work for him, and if they keep going back and forth eternally, then Funny Bee's obviously gonna have the win here. Oh, and Funny Bee might be able to win the top. Uh, sorry, Sticker might be able to win the top yellow as well, but he's going in aggressively. Oh, good whale. He's vulnerable though. 70 health is not a good place to be on. They both double back as well. What is Sticker searching for? I'm not sure the 50 is not there, so he knows that Funny Bee is not available anymore. Ooh, lucky that really didn't hit him. Okay, still kind of got on a yellow, he's got on a mega. So, you know, what's, actually, well, let's, I'll ask you afterwards if uh, I need to. <laughs> the shots the stick hand goes for, he doesn't even <laughs> care. I mean, I guess why not? If, if it's a chance to hit a rail, then go for it, unless you're really trying to manage your ammunition somehow. Yeah, in TDM. I can't believe he does this in TDM. Yeah, I mean, surely not. Oh, funny, they're gonna eat each other up at the top. Funny, we're getting way uh, better go on that fight. Stick and still rocket jumps up to the red arm, and it's gonna meet on the tele exit. Well played by Funny B. <laughs> uh, no, Stick and that's not what you wanna do. Running at him with the gauntlet, man, I, I think that's a pretty bad idea. You know, we were talking about 5%, 15% chances with the first sticker before. I think that was a 0.0, .0 recurring 5% chance of, of actually getting a kill. Yeah, I think it was only going for the Mega. But even then, it's not really worth the steal. No, not at all. But you oh. know, it's, it's blue and glowy. <laughs> Are you sure it's not just you who likes the colors? What's wrong with the colors? I'd prefer it to just pink. No, I don't. Oh, Stickhand's plasma has actually been pretty decent. But it looks like Funny Bee's just taking this one all the way at home. I'm, I'm ready to call this one GG. I was hoping it would be going up to the 9 minute 59 second mark, but I think you know, Funny Bee looks a lot more stable than Stickhand here. In about time as well. And uh, I'm guessing the third map's gonna be Cure. Uh, Cure oh. Heights, actually. Oh, really? So I guess Funny Bee would have picked Cure as a fourth. But look, GG, guys, we're gonna be Funny Bee who's winning map number two. And he's making this one look a lot more convincing. Just map that happened. That was uh, really exactly what Funny Bee needed to do to really stand his ground here in this, uh, in this best of five. And well, obviously I'll be updating the brackets afterwards, but uh, again, if this, we're at the double what? elimination cure. stage, we're at the lower bracket round. So yeah. they're actually going to cure now. So stick they and fix cure. cure. Okay, fair enough, fair enough. And uh, we'll put ourselves into the game. It looks like they're going to be starting this one up. And uh, we will just get ourselves into game in a second as I just changed the, the round. And uh, talk us through the beginning of this, uh, Bruno. I need to know which are you on. I'm on stick hand right now. So you're on stick hand. Oh, he has the LG out, and Funny B has the rockets. Can Funny B if Funny B connects with one rocket as he did, he can safely drop onto the blood onto the yellow and get the frag as he did right now. Wow. And stick hand will he attack at the red? Would not be a bad idea after some damage he did there. Oh, he is. Of course, he's gonna turn up, man. He's, wow, wow, he even gets the kill. I cannot believe he out LG to Funny Bee like that. Yeah, and Funny Bee is on 53% LG. What the hell is going on in this game? Stickhan must have been on double that, and I don't even know if that's possible. So is Funny Bee going to be able to get the red this time, but with a maybe a little bit more peace? Again. Oh, Stickhan, he's going to turn up. He's got the plasma. It was working well for him earlier. Wow. And he's going to work for him again. No comment. No, this just shouldn't be happening. In your in your standard uh, game of Quake Duel, that's not meant to work. Well, depends who's standard. I mean, we have Funny B. I don't think we can go on a standard Quake game with him. And then we have Stick and oh, oh my god! My gosh. See, again, that that does. <laughs> yeah, I, I think what Stick is trying to do is he's trying to make a name for himself. And I think he's beginning to if he keeps on making plays like this. You know, I, I remember casting the games earlier in the last couple of weeks, uh, seeing a few people in chat cheering for Stick Hand, and I'm starting to understand why. This guy has got a very uh, interesting and exciting style to his play. And, and I'm actually kind of sad I haven't watched him 
more previously to this tournament. Funny Beast trying to do the plasma this time, but he did hit a little bit just then. Stick hand gonna make a move over to Mega. I wonder if Funny Beast gonna try and steal red. He gets he's gonna... red, but he's gonna die as well. It might be worth it. I think we'll see in a few moments. If it oh is. no, definitely not worth it. Unless, yeah, even attacking there was not a very good decision, but. If he can attack now again, because now the red is going to be up in 10 seconds and Funny B is supposedly well positioned for it, but he's going to need the weapons. Mm -hmm. And taking the time to go to the weapons might be enough to lose a position on the red. Yeah. Oh wow. The rockets are perfect then. I think Funny B was a little bit too focused on the red armor. And I, I think he kind of lost track of what was important in that fight. And now Stickhand's getting another kill, 7 to 2. I dare say that Funny B is just getting crushed. He's getting funny beat. Yeah, well, if that means crushed, then I'll go with that definition. Okay. <laughs> Interesting rocket jump. Trying Don't to get a better position. For. No, he's just trying to get a better position. Unfortunately, the ceiling was an issue. <laughs> Let's see if Stickhand can get the Mega also. Dropping down, he has actually found Funny Bee, but he doesn't land the first shot. He, he lands two on himself, and uh -oh. he goes to the left there. Just messing up the no, jumps he's... a little bit, but Funny Bee's not around to punish that. But he's going to take the red. Oh, That's there's the a drop from Stickhand! This is going to be a kill for Funny Bee! Unharmed as well! That is precisely what the doctor ordered, but this time... Oh my god, Stickhand pushing him off the yellow 10 health left! Uh, this, this makes sense. Oh, oh wow. my goodness. Can he it's get like... the rail? Oh, Stickhand doesn't even go for the yellow. Fair play, and Funny Bee's got to be thinking, okay, you're probably going for red. And he doesn't want to go for yellow in the end, he thinks it's a, tra a trap. There's the yellow, but he's going to be south on the Mega. Mm -hmm. And Stickhand's going to be on 200, 150. Oh, there we go. Good little rail, but we need more than that from, from Funny Bee. And he does indeed deliver that. Looking for another rail, but Stickhand already making that transition through the teleporter. 45% LG and 100% rail from Funny Bee right now. Oh, are you kidding? Impressive. Two impressives now? Okay. Well, he has got a lot to make up for after the last uh, few maps that we've seen from him. And he definitely needs to connect if he wants to get back in the lead with Stickhand. Oh, this isn't going to work for Funny Bee, but he manages to avoid damage going up the bounce pad. He even goes oh. for the drop. That is ridiculously close. <laughs> One health. Don't jump your crater. Okay, there we go. And I, I, he actually gets the Mega. He's spot stick and though, one second left until uh, it's up. He's not going to be able to get the armor, but he does bring it to a four frag difference now. This is starting to look a bit better for Funny Bee, but he really needs some armor. And he's got to be careful at this yellow. Stickhand's surely going to defend it. Five minutes. He's, he's actually that. getting the rail. Okay. Interesting, so he might want to try to play defensive, or he might just feel like shooting grails in the walls. We can, we can deal with that. I think Funny Bee will. Great rail by Funny Bee. This is and going to give him the Mega and the Red, and maybe even a Frag if he can land another one. Look at all the ways he's trying to hone himself in. Aim for stick yeah. and Finishes off the Lightning Gun, well played. Yes, he lost a lot of time and might lose on the Red now, but stick and actually going away, trying to play much more safely. He's got Yellow also, I think he, he's probably picked up a Green Armor. And Funny Bee's just waiting for a trap, he's like, yep, I know you want that railgun soon. And there it is, Stick and falls for the bait. Well, the Funny Bee didn't want to finish it with the rail shot, that could have been a kill if he didn't go for an air rocket. Definitely. Is Stick and gonna get Mega? Funny Bee itching to get the red, there it is. Mega up in a second, Stick and nowhere near. Funny Bee still has four minutes to make this work. The thing is, now he gave Stick and a, a rail as well, and he needs to be slightly more aggressive. While Stickhand oh, wow. doesn't have that LG, and that's exactly what he needed to do. 45% LG still. That is phenomenal. Why is Stickhand on the Mega? 77% rail as well. Now he's definitely connecting. For all of what he did in connecting Oh my god, man. Amazing. Those are some stats we're seeing right here. 8 to 8. Funny Bee has brought this back hugely. And now, Don't the accuracy. now Stickham's getting used to the fact that Funny Bee's hitting. He might have to switch his game up a little bit for this. 
then we we saw that he was switching his game. He started being much less confident, started to play much much safer. But obviously, he's not really comfortable in playing safe. So this is this is a uh, this is great news for Funny B right now. If he can keep up this control as well and maintain that stack, Astakhan bouncing him off there. That was good for him. But he needs to be careful. Why is he on the mega 10 seconds before? Sticken oh, has 100 100. To wow. defend himself. That was a huge mistake by Funny B. I swear that was just 10 seconds of Funny B being hurt and stick and not. And we don't usually see fights go quite that one sided for such a long period of time. And there we go, we got the Mega up as Stickhan gets it. And I don't even think Funny B heard it getting picked up, so Who hopefully Funny B won't do that again. He's not going for the red. You can tell something definitely has switched in his playstyle, and Funny B didn't pick up the red either yet. Oh dear, he's so weak, and Funny oh. B is gonna bring it one frag closer. If Seekan had the same confidence that he started this tournament with, he does get the frag there, but if he had the same confidence, he would have gotten that red and probably killed Funny B in the process. Mm -hmm. Now he, he knows he. I mean, he, he's showing that there's so much more respect to Funny B now. Yeah. Let's see if Funnybee makes a charge, he does. Stickhand misses the rocket on the exit. Funnybee, oh. he's again, oh. it's like deja vu, man. Funnybee pushed away from the Mega as he drops for it. And Stickhand, he's trying to take this one home. He's just going for flick rockets on the spawn points. That one didn't work. He's not really using the rail. I mean, he didn't connect with any rail so far, so yeah, the rockets will do just fine. Oh wow, you're actually bang on now, man. Oh, there's, there we are, there's the rail. Two rails make it. How many shots, how many rails has he actually fired this game? Seven. Okay, and actually getting the kill then with uh, with the rockets. I think we might be seeing GG's quite soon. Funny we will be uh, getting the mega health, but... I'm prepared for a surprise, but I really think Stickhand's a miles ahead. I'm, I'm gonna have to switch over to Funny B. So well, I don't think he'll be there for much time. So early, yeah. So he was just way too early for it. And that is going to be GG. Funny B calls it. And Stickhan, he's going to put himself on match point here in the Swedish Championships of Quick Live lower bracket round two. That is surprising. It is. And, uh, well, you know, at the same time, these are Stickhan's map picks, presumably. And you said Furious Heights is going to come up next? Mm hmm. Okay. Well, uh, so let's see what that is going to bring us. Um, Funny B was hitting rails heavy and hard uh, at the beginning of Cure. And I, I wonder if he can get a, a few more of them. Uh, Stickhand, though, he was trying to be a little bit crazy. And then he, his, he transferred into, okay, now that I've got the lead, I'm going to go defensive. Then he lost the lead and he reverted back to his original style. And it worked really nicely. Yeah. So I'm, I'm, I don't really know how Stickhand is going to play this. No, not at all. Funny B doesn't either. Probably Stickhand doesn't know either. All right, I am uh, in game right now, and I want to switch over to Funny B off the beginning as he's got that mega health start. And he's got that lightning gun. He probably wants to pick up the armor in this room. Surely Stickhand's gonna get that rail. I don't know if that's the right place to set a trap, really, because surely Stickhand would have wanted to go for the LG next. Yeah, the thing is, funny, but he has no idea where Stickhand's going for. So he's really just taking the safe route, being positioned to then drop to the red as he did right now, and then he can nice. get a frag in here, based on the assumption that Stickhand didn't really uh, delay the red. Mm -hmm. And what would have happened? If, would have happened if you got that assumption wrong? Surely, surely he would have stood there taking a lot more damage. He would just on the high ground. He would, yeah. Stickhand would be above with the rail probably raining down damage on the funny B as he is right now. Mm -hmm. And he would have the LG as well, which he would then drop while funny B would be low. And the multitude of other things would happen like air rockets and whatnot. Wow, the rail. And funny B's got, you know, he's got a huge stack advantage right now. He's got to make sure he doesn't do things on cure, like stand on Mega for 10 seconds and losing all your health. Yeah, that's not really the good thing. No, he goes there with one second before. So we'll right. still have time to get onto the red. Oh. He's a rocket there though. But still got the frag either way. Stickhand's on two health. Uh, was that worth a denial, do you think? Should Stickhand be there? It's it's hard call. I mean, the denial's only worth it based on your next actions. And depends what Stickhand's going to do right now. It doesn't seem like he's going to be able to do anything. Mm -hmm. 
so definitely not worth it. But, ooh. Brutal shots here from Funny Bee. He's got time to get that ready. He's got to be super quick if he wants to get over to Mega. Stickhand might be sitting on this one. No, he's not. He's just down at the bottom. Easy pickings. Funny Bee getting 3-0 up, but look at that. He's got so much health, so much armor. He is confident as hell right now to move in and get Ooh. more kills. This rail, that's, that's going to be another one. Ooh. But he might need to switch. Is Stickhand really going to juke his way around here? How's Funny Bee lost oh so much health? He's, he's going to create one more rail and he can die. Are you kidding me? Oh, oh there we God. go. That almost went horribly wrong. Yeah, I, I think Funny Bee was starting to feel the pressure. And he's way too early on Mega again. Here comes the lightning gun. Can he win the fight though? Wow. Very good fight by Stickhand. Mm -hmm. Now I can do something. To get more LG, he could take the yellow. But he's going to play for that now, and he knows that Funny Bee still doesn't have anything other than the rail. He's gonna collect this red. No delay on the red on the Mega. Yeah, they're gonna, Mega and Red are gonna be up at the same time next time. Funny Bee doing some good damage in this fight. And he's found himself a yo. Let's see if he can get some weapons, because Stickhand, I think, is in a little bit of trouble. Oh, oh wow. Was in a little bit of trouble. Back, yeah, but still, back, Red and Mega better. spawn at the same time. And since you know Stickhand isn't completely stacked, he can definitely try to steal one of them. Yep, that's gonna I think he's gonna pick wrong though. Oh, he's gonna see Stickhand right behind him. He can definitely drop to the red now. <laughs> Stickhand's still going for the crazy angles. And what, like, he's just shooting. So no, that was a 25 health bubble. It wasn't funny, B. I, I'm, I'm kind of a concerned though for Funny Bee, because Stickhand looks like he's actually on a roll once again. It's like it takes him a little bit of time to get into a map, and then once he does, he, he seems inc inc incredibly strong. Doesn't pick up the red though, and Funny Bee probably thinks that he picked up the red. Might see it's up now, but it will be suicidal to drop, but Funny Bee drops regardless, and death could be to his death. Yeah, great drop. <laughs> Funny Bee was hoping that that would go slightly differently, but it absolutely did not. And it is this stick and uh, on his way to bringing map number three home and getting himself through lower bracket round one. What, what stick and he's doing there? Like after he kills Funny B every time he goes to the LG because Funny B spawns with the rockets and he's being really really predictable left because he keeps taking the jump pad to the LG. Unfortunately, stick and did not get the frag there, which allowed Funny B to get the red. Oh, Funny B has an LG. Done it. Oh my God, those rails from stick and. I can't believe it. He's Again, DLG, Funny Bee, stop jumping to that LG. <laughs> it, it seriously costed him all the five frags that Stickhand has right now. Uh, Stickhand getting himself a pretty easy red in the end. I think Funny Bee's gonna have to make way for Stickhand and let him pick up Mega. Definitely, he's, he's on a survival mode now. <laughs> But it's halfway, man, and there's still so much action between these two. Oh, LG coming out should be another kill for Stickhand, but the rockets are great from Funny Bee. And the amount of spam is high. Funny Bee on 18 points of health. No health bubbles on the map besides the 15, so he can wield the knight. Or not? No, he doesn't. He chooses not to. He goes down towards the. Was that a missed time from him? It's as if he dropped down for it. Oh, oh dude. goodness, Funny B. He even had a 50, he didn't have to fight. Could just go to the 50 and then see if the Mega was up. Which he does eventually. Stickham's really good though at punishing uh, Funny B for these item pickups. I mean, what's, what's your biggest word of advice to Funny B at the moment? Stop going to the LG when you spawn. Yeah. And right now he just needs to pick a good fight. He just needs to survive. Wait for a second to make a mistake. He's been doing several mistakes. But he just gave the, the red Funny B. Now Funny B can attack at the Mega. He doesn't need to be completely aggressive as he is right now. However, that works out very fine and he can get an LG. Uh, oh, break, that is. the railness as well. I mean, stick out. sorry, Funny B would have survived, but that rail could definitely have helped him off the spawn. Oh my god, the plasma coming through. He's not hitting too much of it. And Funny B, he's going to be able to tie the game up. I'm glad he took my advice. <laughs> <laughs> now what's he gonna do? He, does head over to the LG he goes to the LG, 
and f and stick and not doing the same mistake that Funny Bee was. He's not just jumping on the jump pad there. Oh, the rocket! Nowhere rocket to follow. And Funny Bee's got time to get a good position onto Red Army. He's actually going to drop. God, the red, those rockets are so, so. Close. Don't. Go. <laughs> What's gonna happen? <laughs> Funny Bee does get the crack. The mic losing red though. Yeah. The micro dodges in those fights are insane. What, what? what the hell were you even shooting at, Funny B? <laughs> you didn't like the texture there on the wall. <laughs> oh man, he's eating rockets again. He's gotta be careful, a half decent rocket would kill him, even a bad rocket would kill him. He hits two rails. Let's see if he gets that spawn on shotgun. That, he does actually get it, but he barely hits him. And Stickhand walks away with his life. What, what is funny be? Are you gonna get, Oh my god, this, his shotgun was so sketchy just then. He gets the kill, but he is barely alive. He wants to go through the LG. As always. Oh my god. This is so, so risky. Oh my goodness, oh, Stickhand. Wow. What a perfect trip. Funny B can't get the Mega, he was probably hoping he could. Air Rocket's not gonna hit. Oh, he does hit one actually. Stickhand does get the kill and is back in the lead now. We've got less than two minutes to go. Remember, this is Stickhand match point for Stickhand. He wants to play out of his mind. He does not want to let Funny B get to the tiebreaker. And Funny B, oh, one second until that red spawns. Stickhand, he's gonna let him have it. Funny Bee makes this it away. Be very good for Funny Bee. He managed to get out of there, but he's taking so much damage. Oh. He is railable. Yep, and there's the rail. Crazy rails here once again from Stick Funny Bee still has a chance to attack at this. And again, he goes to the LG. Stop going to the LG when you spawn. It is, it's, it is that hard. <laughs> I think you need to have a word with him afterwards. Oh, there's a trade though on the items. And Funny Bee can get lower yellow, he can get a rail. And what we... for him, like Stick and he's not stopped getting the frag that the LG after the third, but he's still doing a lot of damage there. Stickhand's gonna play defensive right now. He knows he's got a win here. If he just goes defensive, funny be getting hit by a lot of lightning gun. He's a rail right now. He's going to drop onto Stickhand. One rail, one more, who gets the frag, and there he is. Wow, he hits two vertical shots. He goes to the jump up. This is risky though. You don't have in. more rockets. Oh my god, he's completely maniac. He ties it up though. Fair play to Funny Bee. He's done it. 30 seconds to go, but this is he very dangerous. He cannot, he cannot stay in here. He's this doing it. He doesn't care he, about it. He doesn't care at all. And he actually got the frag. Oh my goodness. He just needs to hold on tight right now. Funny Bee, don't, don't go for the move. kill. Don't move at just all. Let go of your keyboard and mouse. Please. <laughs> okay, well, he okay. hasn't moved, so maybe he's let go of the keyboard. He's listening to Ten him. Ten seconds. Where where is a uh, stickhand? He's uh, hunting down here. He looks he over the yellow. Funny. He goes the wrong way. And funny be he is gonna be able to get the map win here on number four. And we are gonna be going to the tiebreaker. Oh my goodness. That was a that was a pretty nuts game. Stickhand man, he was so close to getting himself through to the lower bracket semis. And uh, he did not quite have it in him at the end. That was uh, very, very close. So, Funny Bee, he's still alive in the tournament, so stick hand. And this next map is going to decide, well, which one's going to remain alive in the tournament for a couple of hours longer. And I think uh, shortly after this game, we're either going to be going to Juro versus Puri, or we're going to be starting to see the winner bracket semis. Uh, so you guys can look forward to those matches. Pardon? If, if you guys thought the, the previous maps were didn't make any sense, then wait for this. Uh, man... Toxicity can go either way, though. I'm hoping, yes, though, it's but I'm what sure you it said. won't make any sense. <laughs> I hope you're right. Uh, let's go into game while these guys warm up. Um, and favorites now, after seeing the last four maps, what do you think? None. It's equal, even uh, between the two players. I, I'm not so sure, man. I think Funny Bee might be able to handle the chaotic uh, pace a little better than Stickhand, but... You know, really? Stick... I, I would say it's the other way around. I'd really? say Funny Bee's biggest problem is to actually stay composed while Stickhand does the Funny Bee on Funny Bee. I don't know. I, yeah, I think Stickhand's obviously competing to be the next Funny Bee. 
Yeah. Well, I mean, I'm certainly, I think the community's uh, eyes will have opened to Stickhan, and I hope that Stickhan is going to continue playing competitively, no matter what happens in the range of the tournament. And Funny B, he, he always lurks around. We, we know he's going to be here forever. <laughs> he's going to play Quake until he's an old, aging, elderly man. And he's, he's never going to appear at a LAN. No. It doesn't matter what you tell him. And this is how you practice your rail, ladies and gents. If you're Funny B. Oh my goodness. It's also how you get really seasick watching Quake. Yeah. Take a break after this. Pardon? I think I need a break after that. <laughs> Stick hands readied up. We're just waiting on Funny B, and that's it, guys. Gonna get ourselves into game. Um, let, let, let the story begin and end here on Toxicity. And uh, I am going to be on stick and off the beginning. He does get the early red. And he does get the satisfaction of having the lightning against something Funnybee probably wants soon. This might be first kill for Stickhand. Funnybee is doing next to nothing, but the LG is all out for Stickhand. Oh, the rocket's not going to hit enough. First blood has been spilled. And he doesn't have the rails and Stickhand. Using that LG to its full advantage. Funny, we need something to reply with. He gets an LG. And he's obviously been very, uh, a lot, very comfortable with the LG spawns on this map. Trying to do damage. A good finish from Stickhand. The thing is, you can't just run at Stickhand with the LG because Stickhand has very good aim with it as well. And if you're on a 50 stack disadvantage or a 100 stack disadvantage, you're just not going to get anything. Yeah. And we'll certainly have to think of different ways to get into this. I wonder if he wants to invest some more frags into doing that. Well, you've got to do that at the right time, otherwise it can go horribly wrong. The thing is, if he does that, if he invests like three frags and then gets one, I'm sure Sticken will just invest three of his own to try and get the control back. There we are, we've got a big fight down there. Funny be doing a lot of damage. Stickhand trying to defend, we've got the plasma gun coming out and it does work for him. Funny he's on the board. Can he uh, have any kind of continuation to this? Ooh, lower yellow is up. Oh my god, oh, stick out of the air right. rocket! And oh, he just he swipes the, the yellow beneath his feet. Oh my okay. god. But this, this is bad because there's still some time until items are up. 50 health bubble. It's going to be a sigh of relief for stick hand. Oh my. Is he going to appear at the mag again? Nope. And he does miss the shot. Is he going to drop? He does. Good oh. from Funny B, and there's that one. And now Funny B Rocket jumping around a little bit. He's found Stickhand at the bottom, he does hit the rail. Stickhand, oh my god, it's a mutual frag in the end. Fantastic Direct Rocket. Air rocket. Yeah. Is Funny B gonna go for another shot over here? He's just picked up rail. I think he's sitting on the red armor. So he's getting it immediately off the spawn. He might even rocket jump up to have a go here. Still a second until Mega Spawn stick and there in time. Three health left here. Oh, the rail is gonna hit. Magnificent. He's pulling out the moves when he needs to. He seems almost he seemed a little bit nervous at the beginning of this tour, but now Stickhand looks brilliant. Seven yeah. to three. Oh, Funnyb, can he get this one down just in time with two health? I, I'm wondering right now, how do you cast the frag movie? <laughs> oh my god, no, another two health left for Funnyb, he wants his 225s. He can get them, and the yellow. He's gonna be forfeiting the mega though for this. And here comes the railgun. I think, yeah, that 50 health level looks too delicious to say no to. He's gotta be super careful, that red. Is it gonna be worth the expense? I think it, it looks That's like yes at the moment. One more way to kill stick on. Can funny be connect though? Can't even find an angle. There he is. You should get that lower yellow now. Well, where's stick on? Oh, he's right below my assume through the grates. This is like a horror movie again. And wow, he even gets the kill. Funny bee's on his way back. A little bit of a slow one. switch. LG to Plasma to LG. Oh, he's so low on ammunition. One try between them. Oh, oh. my god. Oh. 
What is the cap doing? I don't know. I think as soon as you hit that rocket on oh my god. He hit the rocket on funny being the knockback from the rocket made him fall into the slime. Oh dear. Oh, funny he was sat on the mega health. This is dangerous, but he hits the rocket. 25 health that will almost save Stickhan's life. This item's not up for a while. Funny Bee just needs any kind of health he can get. Oh no, Funny Bee! We're almost at the halfway point, and I can't tell what's gonna happen. A rail being hit. Funny Bee, he wants to defend the red armor, but he can't do it. He's probably gonna die over here. There we go. Is stick hand gonna get control for any longer than about 20 seconds, is what I'm curious about. There isn't control in a game like this. No? There are frags and damage. In an unorganized and chaotic manner. Oh, Funny Bee looks in trouble though. Stick hand seriously stacked right now. He's gonna move back over to that red. And that is gonna be 200 200 for him. No, he's, he's moving away. He wants to get more kills. That rail somehow hits. And he's somehow. actually. I mean, wow, he just baits uh, Funny Bee into that red. I like what Stick hand just did. Yeah, and now he knows that the top yellow is up. Now that he's definitely in control. Can even get a frag in here, but it doesn't connect. It's okay, he has the bottom yellow to fall back on, but Funny Bee's trying to do a lot of damage. Nice for Stick Hands, it's so messy with his aim. Fortunately for him, he's hitting most of the important shots. Funny Bee though, he got onto red, another rail would be great for him. He switches over to the rockets. Really? Is there going to be a direct? He has the rail to use, but he said he's going to rare rockets. Oh man. Stickhan is constantly putting himself in the right position though to go for that final shot per kill. I feel like Stickhan is playing so well at the moment though. Like way, way, he's completely exceeded all my expectations of what he's going to do for us this tournament. Yep, he wants to meet Dark Horse. Yeah. 13 to 7. We've still got over three and a half minutes to go. But right now, Funny Bee looks like he needs a lot longer. Oh, he just crouches on the wall. Look at Stick, and he doesn't give Funny Bee any room to breathe. I'm quite right, man. He shouldn't. He is making, doing an amazing job right now. And if this carries on for another minute or so, then it's going to be GG. Simple as. Funny Bee just needs a frag pretty much in the next 10 seconds oh, and one health one health okay. that's d9 right there i dare call that a clutch rail man funny be though looking for another rail it was it still wouldn't even kill stick and three, three. health funny he's probably smashing his keyboard and wondering why the hell won't stick and die i didn't want to call gg man I think I think I might have to soon. I feel like Stickham's really outplaying Funny Bee in the basically the last five minutes of this game. Funny Bee doesn't just need a kill to happen soon. He needs a kill oh. to translate into yeah, a and whole it's bunch just of not gonna happen. It's safe to call the GG now. And Stickham, it's it's really playing out of his mind. Finally, Funny Bee gets something, but. He needs a lot right now, and yeah, <laughs> he's only gonna get. He's a pummel, pummel. man. That's, that's not good. That's not good. It's funny, be I mean, he's, I mean, Stickan, he's having control, and on top of that, he's doing more damage than Funny Bee, just because he doesn't let Funny Bee even think of a plan to plan a fight. You were totally right, though, when I when you said before. I thought that Funny that Stickan wouldn't be able to keep up with Funny Bee on toxicity, but he more than did. Yeah, it's, it's Funny Bee that can't keep up with Stickhand's pace. And this is where I think the aggressive style of Stickhand's really been working. When he managed to have that control, it, it just, you know, it worked together in a harmony so well. 20 to 7 at the moment. And this is a tiebreaker map. It looks like Funny Bee, well, he, he went down in the quarters in the winner bracket to Tox. And now against Stickhand in the lower bracket round 1. He's going to be saying goodbye to his chances in the tournament. And you know, Stickhan was previously a guy who I was putting, okay, probably going to lose winner bracket quarters, probably even go out in the lower bracket round one. But he's made it to the lower bracket semi, so GG, well played. Stickhan is going through.
So, no. how do you wrap up a, a series like that? I don't. I don't think there are enough words to describe the madness <laughs> of these two maniacs. No, it's it's been just crazy what we've had from these two. I'm really happy though that we got to see this game because I didn't know if we were going to even see all of the, the lower bracket round one matches. Uh, next.